This video is regarding the Canon Selfie CP1300 versus 1500. So there are few differences. So first difference is about the screen. You can see this screen is tiltable and this is 3.2 inch screen. Whereas the screen is fixed and it's 3.5 inch wide. If you make it flat like this, you might notice a little bit difference. The screen is bigger here and this screen is smaller. From here we can clearly see that the screen is much clear and bright here. Whereas the colors are not that much clear. Another difference is regarding the buttons. You can see there are lots of buttons on this panel. Whereas you have only few buttons on this panel. That means it's much easier to navigate from one section to other and you can just press any button and go there. Whereas if, whereas in CP1500 it takes a little bit longer to reach to a particular point because you have to go through the system and here you can directly press anything. For example for Wi-Fi you can click on the Wi-Fi straight away it will take you to the Wi-Fi whereas here you have to select buttons and then click OK to go there. So you can see the difference and there is a home button here you can go easily back whereas in this you have to press this button few times and then you go to the home for example in this I can show you if you insert a SD card here now it will show up the photos you can simply click on the print button and it will take you to the print section directly now if I go to this if I go to the CP1500, you have to install here. Now there are number of steps you have to follow before you reach to the print section. So, that means it takes a little bit longer. If we talk about the printing speed, it takes around a minute whereas this one takes just around 41 seconds. So that's around 20 second difference. And the last difference is regarding the sound. For example, if I switch it off and if I switch off this as well. Now I'm going to restart it and you can hear the sound. So I'm just going to press it all together. CP1300 makes a lot of noise and it takes a little bit longer to start whereas CP1500 takes less time and makes no sound at all when it's starting. There's another one difference that is CP1300 uses the USB slot that means you can use any USB and you can start printing photos whereas this printer has a USB-C port that means you can use only USB-C you can't use any other kind of USB here now if we talk about the similarities they both uses the same paper tray same paper and the same ink cartridge so that means there is no key difference in the print quality you can see both prints on the same paper same film so there can't be a difference between the print quality it's only matter of speed and look so this looks little bit different than this one also the method of using this printer is same you can open from this side to load the paper tray and that is also in this one and on the side you have the option to load the film for example here so this also has the same option you have to load it here so in the end I can say if you want to buy any one of these there is no big difference in the price they are almost similar price right now and in case you want something where you can tilt the screen use the buttons so that's more easy to use now in case you want newer design with less buttons i think you can go for this and there's a little bit bigger screen here also you can look from any angle you will see clearly what is there in the screen whereas in this one you have to tilt it to see clearly so hopefully this video will help you to decide which printer do you want to buy thanks for watching